think we want to speak. So let the crowd have it. So we can try and play the distance game. He does no damage whatsoever. So having 4% move speed slow is actually the best thing he gives. Top lane, Ohio, as well as Arteezy, already battling it out. And he, do, he does go for the first speed. Thank you. Six seconds, and Kuro's got his... his oh, oh, that's up a really good ice Johnny, shard. Out of hold, Johnny in position. Kuro's running in. Johnny doesn't want to be oh, here. He oh. doesn't have enough damage. Okay, He's too far away. Him. Now he does, but Ohio's right behind him. Zai, he doesn't have mana for the shards. Then again, he can take that back. He has, he's walking around with a the mango. They lock him in the cogs. There's a explosion. Ohio, the shards will get the kill. Zai will take it out while up on top lane. KOSY blinks away from Arteezy. But is Zai out of the bushes? I don't think he is. Mushy with a haste rune. Chasing him down. Zai's in trouble on bot lane. Into the tree line, wants to cut through a quick salve, and he is dead. The Dragon Knight will get revenge, but it's still technically only one for one, even though the board says three for one. It's very stressful for them, I think, right now. They feel like they can't really find a grip in their lanes, and it's only going to get harder. So, yep. I, in my opinion, a lot is on the shoulders of Kachik in this game oh. with the Disruptor. I think he has to get some really good storms as mid lane. Yeah, this Mushi is Dragon Knight is going to be in a lot of trouble. Might actually be able to survive this defensive TP. Absolutely not. Uh, at the same time, up on top lane, Hookshot into Cog to Barrier Assault and full Sonic Wave committal. Killed off Puppy. That's all they managed to achieve with that kill. And Fnatic, they're going to need more than a support kill for this. And in fact, Arteezy battling up against KOXY. Can't blink himself away, so KOXY is dead. And S4, with the TP up, grabs himself a double kill. No more mana for more zips, but this Orchid is rapidly approaching. The top tower gets denied. The Bloodseek is fine with it. And again on bottom lane, we're going in for the ball. After Johnny, where's your punch? There it is. Suicide not even required. The mines are now doing the work at level three. And they get the kill on the Undying Secret. They want to try and fight on bottom lane. S4, there's not a lot of matter really to work with. And with this Tuscar Sigil up, they're slowing everything down. It's almost that, in fact, the Cower is not going to kill it off. It's now a two-way speed. There's your stun. Snowball in Sonic Wave going to miss. They're inside the Snowball with a Blood Rite also coming in. They have to back up behind the tower, but S4 is falling them down. Picks up Ohio. They've lost Queen of Pain as well. Mushy, how long can he survive a little bit longer with that Soul Rip from Johnny? But that's not going to be much longer as Arteezy in behind the trees, killing off Johnny, moving to Mushy. It's a rampaging secret into the minds of Techies. They were hiding in the tree line from Koro. He'll find the kill. Rupture on Mushy with the shards. They try and separate the fight too. The rest of Secret are not coming up to fight for Koro. Well, there's a little present there, and Ohio's going to open it. And with the explosion, it's going to go down too. Suicidal. Will barely dare go into their own jungle. Look at them right now. Like they're really hesitant to just walk up the staircase. And in fact, now they're, now they're warning the hook shot up, they found Koro. Suicide is not a bubble, but they lock him inside the wall. This will be the death of Koro right now. Disruptor will take it, and Puppy stunned up. They'll find both the supports here of Secret, but at the same time, the Orca jump. KOXY, Ice Lake on the back end, he'll die, and Puppy, the Shallow Grave, it won't keep him alive long enough. The Blood Rite was going to give him enough space to get back, but Mushy stuck with it. He found the kill. Look at the kill death score. It's not representative, because I think four of Koro's deaths are suicides. So it's technically 7 to 14, I believe. So the lead for Secret is bigger than it just looks here. Oh, and S4. S4. Yes. S4 with a double damage rune as well to rip through a high. The Soul River will keep him up. And S4, he's low. He's going to get out of here. Ball lighting's away. They got the kill. It was actually Techies that managed to get it. I don't know if that's actually with a right click or not. But S4, Shallow Grave. Is there enough time? And ball up. He doesn't have a lot of life for one shot. He comes to Sonic Wave. Guru will commit suicide. And gets the kill on the Queen of Pain. Into the shards. They're trying to control Johnny, but it's actually Arteezy in the middle of the fight. All the movement speed in the world. Johnny is still pretty low. He's trapped in there with Arteezy, who moves over for a double kill. Head for pulling back Lockwood. This will be a dieback for Ohio. His six heroes down. The price was still the buyback of S4. I think they have a pretty good shot. Like, the really difficult part of the game is after losing the laning stage, not getting completely run over until minute 25. Like, this fight is a very, very big combat. Arteezy coming in, Rupture, zip zip goes S4, chasing after Mushi, the blood right, perfect position. Mushi's not gonna like this one, especially with the Orchid. The Soul Rip can't keep him alive, and the Battery Soul can't hold him up either. In fact, the Orchid was used over from the Disruptor, so they found two for this. Ohio, no stuns, he'll be able to deep himself away to safety, but Johnny's on the run and losing armor quickly because this weave that's now on top of him. Arteezy, all the movement speed in the world to chase after, he goes down! Bloodseeker being brought down by the tower, and Johnny will survive through all of this, and in fact, Secret in a really bad position. KOX Y with a Sonic Wave to heal from Puppy. It keeps him alive for now. Shadow Grave on S4. No mana left. Just tries to turn the damage into him. He'll die. There goes Dragon Simon. Lestekis will again blow himself up.
But S4, not pushed back by the cogs. Okay, he walks into him. <laughs> Sentry Ward is, actually, I think it's just out of range. It is. It clips the edge of the mine, but doesn't hit the middle of it, so it shouldn't reveal it. Now Hookshot up, but already Koro! Double kill on the three! Butter, bing, butter, double. Kegger, right now on top of this hillside. No one wants to walk up there. And they can't get close enough to kill off, like, to even contest Roshan. S4 now gets an Aegis Immortal. This is the second gone uncontested. You can get snowballed out, you can... Like, the second you drop low two, then Arteezy's got the, like, max movement speed. Just it, is not, not max. it is not a safe play, but it's the only play. So, you kind of, you're kind of forced to do this, oh, and... this could be a good play. S4 oh, he's he's back in. Goes for the disruptor, but you got the blink dagger now on Mushy jumping in on S4 with the tombstone down. S4 doesn't really have a lot of mana here. He does, however, have one a courier kill and two an acres of the immortal. So they find themselves a kill. They try and drag them back up to the mine. And now Walrus punch up with the shards. They isolate Ohio, protect him inside the snowball. The clocks might go down, and now they come out. They're so low with the shadow wave damage. They kill up clockwork. S4 still alive. Remember, he's got acres the immortal. Kuro glimmer cakes himself away. Says he on 22 live. Now they Please scream in, but you're approaching death, Mushy. The BKP, half a second, it's gonna go! And boom! Four heroes down, about to be five. Johnny Orkin, if the snowball comes in, it's all five dead. Disruptor, this fight's gone so long, or he's at so level, he's already respawned. Has it, so. <laughs> the mine just gets planted again after he steals the creep. There's just nowhere the Fnatic can feel free to do what they want. Well, maybe in the middle lane, Hookshot down on Zai, but Snowball, well, it's actually on cooldown, but they'll still commit the ultimate in from the Disruptor, but in comes S4 with the right, they're going to try and glimpse him straight back out again, but the damage has already been done to the Undying, Old Puppy is still killing a Disruptor on the sidelines, you got the rest of them on the front lines, Techie killing off the track at night, and Queen of Pain also not healthy on S4, slices him through with Ball Lightning, from one side of the river to the They should definitely be able to get the tier 3 here. They're not going to be scared, even if there were buybacks. I'm not sure Secret even needs to be nervous about taking this fight. Coral will be taking out the tower very soon. Good timing in the Glyph here from Fnatic. Will delay it as much as they can. It's still 15 seconds. Arteezy is hitting very, very hard and fast with this Blood Rage. Look, look at Kuro's prep already. He's putting kegs on the back lines as well as stasis traps. So if Fnatic do try and chase them out to get these, like, these runaway kills, then Kuro's just gonna punish a hook shot in from Ohio, and maybe now they have enough damage, but no one's easy. Forced off down the cogs, they'll run back. Remember that one keg is still there, which is standing on top of it. But where's your damage? S4 pulled back, awkward up. Shallow Grave will buy protection, which means he's got jump ball time. Away to safety with the TP. Another oh. Sonic wave reaches it from KYXY. S4 will drop, but it's a trap! They're in on KYXY! Double keggers, do they want to throw it down? More support coming in! No, 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 no. Triple kill for Koro! Mistakes were made and traps were triggered! And now even Mushy locked inside an icy prison of shards! And he will go down, he wants at least a kill up, but he can't get anything! GG! 30 minutes! Fnatic have been 2-0 out by Secret Techies! Wonderful combo, wonderful play! And smiles all round! <laughs> That is just like those kind of strategies are just it's such a strange game.